Well, what a week it's been for Alex Belfield. In the last year, he's been arrested five times. He's been strip searched. He's had his, he's had his front doors kicked in. He's had his computer equipment confiscated. Uh, he, he, absolutely un unbelievable, unbelievable. He, he's made allegations that the police officers have been openly lying about the, the way that his case has been handled. Um, luckily for Alex, Conservative MP Andrew Bridgen, who I'm going to be speaking to this week about this, um, intervened and contacted the Home Secretary Priti Patel. Uh, but but, but I, 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 I find this very, very worrying. We, we've learned in the, in the last year, or we've seen in the last year, that the Metropolitan Police, Nottinghamshire Police, they, they do seem to have a, have a political bias. Um, and, and for me, that's not the job of the police. It's the police's job to to defend and uphold the law. That's it. They shouldn't be bending the knee. They shouldn't be bowing to any pressure groups. They should be there to be allowed to do their jobs and do, and defend and uphold the law. But Alex Belfield is, is a is a is a is an interesting example of what the state are capable of if they're allowed to to to. To, to, to go down the path that they would appear to be going down. I don't want to talk too much about Julian Assange, but um, I, I, for one, am very concerned with the way that he's been uh, treated in, in the last uh, you know, couple of years since, uh, since, his, since his arrest. But Alex Belford is an interesting one. He's, he's now, I believe, taking legal action against certain police officers and Nottinghamshire uh, police, as well as um, some other people. So it'll be interesting to see how that how that pans out. But will he get any more visits? He's had an NFA now this week uh, and no further action from Nottinghamshire police. But will, will he wake up at two o'clock in the morning and find somebody kicking his doors in again? I, I wonder what's going to, I wonder what, how, how this is going to, how this is going to play out. I'm going to be speaking uh, this week to Andrew Bridgen, Conservative MP, who very kindly stuck his neck out and, and helped and helped Alex. So please do tune in. Uh, it'll be advertised on Now Is The Time TV within the next 24 to 48 hours. Look forward to seeing you.